referee tonight. In the middle is, uh, with the grey hair there is Gary Lord, and he's uh, supported by Craig Hammond, who's a uh, wash art, works in uh, research finance, and Michal Carrier. So tonight's Bucks big match then is uh, Bucks Premier North, men's football. Top of the table is Sterling. At the moment we've got uh, seven points in four games. Upper in third with six and three. Um, but I've actually got the team to be there, so... So, uh... Going to be a lot of pick up for yeah. Gary Lord getting us underway. Hello and welcome to the Loughborough University Stadium. Um, this is the Play With Pride big match today. Loughborough uh, first team men's football are going to be playing Nottingham. Um, instantly Loughborough are looking, forward to, uh, looking to get forward. Ooh, big tackle in there from Sam Downey. And it's a throw into Loughborough. Um, so the, this match was preceded by um, a lovely ceremony inside um, hosted by Rob Whittaker and Stefan Lloyd uh, to launch the Play With Pride campaign Ooh, a nasty as a free there. kick is given to Loughborough. Yeah, uh, so uh, Rob Whittaker and Stefan Lloyd hosted a brilliant ceremony inside uh, to launch the Play With Pride campaign. That is the campaign um, to... Uh, boost the profile of LGBT athletes within sport and uh, look for an air of tolerance all around within sports starting at our university. Uh, we also released uh, the video that went with the campaign which I managed to get a sneaky line in, I'm not sure how but I did, um, but also featured uh, people such as Paula Radcliffe, Jimmy Anderson, Alistair Cook, Joe Root, Jamie Dwyer, um, Adam Jamili, um, yeah, fantastic video. That'll be online now for you to be, for you to watch. Um, so, yeah, I'm Bryn Wilkes, and I'm being joined by Ed Radford today. Hello there. How are you, Ed? I'm alright, thank you. Ooh, good free kick from Loughborough. Yeah, there, not, yeah the not a bad effort that one, was it? So, good early signs there for Loughborough. Uh, we've also identified a bit of a bit of a problem, haven't we, Ed? Uh, a little bit. So we're at the back um, of the stand up on the balcony at the moment as the uh, goal kick is played short there to the left hand side. Um, and we have people sat all in front of us. And I tell you what, if Loughborough score, we're going to struggle to be able to see anything, aren't we? Oh, absolutely. I won't be able to see a thing. <laughs> it won't be ideal. We might have to stand up ourselves, I think. Certainly. But you never know. We might get carried away in there anyway. Mm, Nottingham there with the three ball, not paying off at all. So Nottingham throwing now, taken quickly. So Loughborough coming into this match, top of the table, nine points from four matches. Uh, they made the final um, of the Bucks Championships uh, last year. I watched that game against Sterling, a 2-0 defeat there down in Surrey. Poor cross there from Nottingham, being picked up by the keeper very well. So this is Williams, back inside to the centre back there. Lapper on the attack now. I tell you what, it's quite a, quite a high defensive line Nottingham were playing there. There were a few players um, in purple looking to get on the end of the through ball there. I wonder if that's something we're going to see for the rest of the match. I think they're certainly trying to intimidate Lapper early on, trying to get the ball as far up the pitch as possible. We'll wait and see if they can keep that up throughout the game. Nottingham throw in here. Poor throw in from Nottingham, taken by Loughborough. Bit of a waste there. Loughborough seem to be sporting a very rainbowy sock today in honour of the pay for pride. Does it very good, I must say. Yeah, and also prior to kickoff as well, uh, you might well have seen it on the cameras before the match. Um, they got everyone in the stand to stand up holding pieces of card uh, to make a rainbow shape in the stand. I mean, I was right behind it, so I couldn't see anything, but I'm sure it, it looked great. The back of it looked fantastic. <laughs> uh, Loughborough moving to the, uh, Nottingham, sorry, moving down the right hand side. Now that's cleared up very well there by Menahan. And 
and uh, I'm afraid to say we're in that area of the pitch that we can't quite get our eyes on right now, so <laughs> we're going to leave this up to you. Play closed down by the Loughborough players. Ooh. Referee just having a word here, cutting anything out early on. I think this is just going to be a telling off this time, isn't it? Just a warning, ref yeah. wants to keep his cards in his pocket early on, I think. It's always an interesting vibe when you have an event like this where it started kind of so warmly and so nicely and so for such a good cause. And you almost forget that there's a match to be played on the flag's going up there on the far side. He looked offside to me, to be honest. I don't think it's much of a complaint there. It's a good run, though. Nice yeah, to see good the vision. Run. And like I was saying, I, I wonder if that's something they're going to look to exploit for the rest of the match. Certainly, if we can keep on side, that is something I think we're going to see a lot more of. The kick played high up the field into the corner. They just don't seem to have the attacking flair at the moment, Nottingham. They're not getting the ball in the box as much as I think they'd like. They are very high up the pitch, but they don't seem to be doing much with it. Well, there's not a lot of uh, short passing going on, really, is it? It's a, it's a lot of just looking to get forward straight away without really controlling anything. Oh, absolutely. I'll tell you what, it's a nice ball from the keeper there. No, no, no. This is some good play from Loughborough, holding the ball, moving it around. Throw and taken by Callum Williams there. That's a poor throw, I'm afraid. Well, it was a nice attempt to the back heel, anyway. It's always good to see. It's a flare early on. This looks like a good attack. Oh, closed down early on by the high defensive line from Nottingham. That's a poor ball down to the left hand side for Nottingham. You're absolutely like, right about what you said earlier. They are just playing the long ball at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> Loughborough seem a lot more happy to move the ball around a bit. And there's another run here coming through the centre who doesn't look happy. But yeah, the flag's up. He wanted the ball first time there. It's a very, another very encouraging run though. Not sure if that was taken from the right spot, I'll be honest, but we're gonna play on. This looks onside. Oh. Oh. Not even seem to be playing a two on one sort of tackling scheme, closing down the Luffer players very quickly. He's gotta be careful here, Minan. Dealt with very well from the centre back. <laughs> Free kick for Loughborough here. Has lost all this time. I wonder if not to give it a break here. It's down the right hand side. Loughborough just slowing it down here, taking control of the play. It's a poor kick from the keeper. Free kick taken quickly. It's a nice looking ball through that, but mopped up very well there by the Loughborough defence, who haven't seemed particularly unduly worried by anything that's come their way so far. 
That kind of pass won't help though. And that's a fantastic intervention. That was a real do or die moment for Loughborough there. Yeah. They needed to get that ball out. And now they can look to break down on the right hand side. Ooh. Committed slide tackle there, it did pay off. Both defensive lines very high at the moment. And it's another ball over the top, this time down the right hand side. Oof. Slightly too long there. <laughs> so 10 minutes in, there's not been any real clear cut chances. We had that early free kick, uh, which went over the bar. And other than that, not really much to speak of, really. There's been a lot in the midfield. Yeah. The short pass in the midfield, and then it seems to just be a long ball over the yeah. top. Oh, cheap corner conceded there, though. So here's a chance for Loughborough. The most promising chance of the match they've had, really. First 10 minutes, it'd be good to get an early goal, cement themselves into the game. <laughs> Ball comes in here. It's gone to the front of the box. Kept out by Nottingham very well. Loughborough back on the attack here. A really nice ball there. Oh, this is fantastic football from Loughborough. Great, ball great comes pace. Into the box. Oh, oh, the header just not with enough power on it. Could have gone anywhere, that couldn't it? Quick reactions though. It's good to see. This is the kind of attacking play that Loughborough need. Can we call that a shot? Really? Can we, we call that attempt to kind of hit him, really, isn't it? That's <laughs> attempt number one. <laughs> Off target, but <laughs> off target, yeah. There's only one stat that matters at the end of the game. That's entirely true. And that's that everyone had a good time, isn't it? Is that right? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. I mean, tonight, I think that's what it's all about. <laughs> Shot here from Nottingham, way over the bar. Bit of a waste as teammates applaud him, but I wonder if there's a little bit of resentment there as well because there were a couple of men free, especially on the right hand side. Just lend back a bit too much on that yeah. one. Pitch seems to have opened up a bit now, a bit more movement, a bit more space. Using the wings now. Oh, That's lovely ball. Go on, if he gets there. There's two men arriving brilliant. in the box now. Can't quite find any of them, and Nottingham should be able to deal with this comfortably. It's a nice ball, actually, out to the right flank. Brilliantly closed down there. But throw into Loughborough. That's a Hatton ball, is it not? The ball over the top, the keeper's out, and yeah, the sensible option, I think. Playing itself for nil, safe for a nil-nil. I think it's a throw-in, but it's in that spot of the pitch where we can't see again. <laughs> again, you at home will know better than us. So this is Herbert looking uh, to move the ball forward again. Can kind I of keep going? That's great. It's down to the corner, looking for the cross here. So it'll be another corner for Loughborough. Lots of the Loughborough players pitch moving moving up the pitch now. That's a fantastic yeah, ball in space. Flags goal. up again. I must say it didn't look offside from here, but I'm in the wrong angle. I'll tell you what, I mean, I know you said only one start matters at the end of the match, but if it's offside, Loughborough in charge right now. We're certainly doing well. It's three <laughs> nil.
again it's another ball with not really much behind it not really much thought behind it just looking to hit it forward Loughborough seem to be playing a sort of 4-5-1 four, formation here with sort of the one up front mm. to run run in behind the Nottingham players and to be honest the, the way the way the defensive line is I recommend he stay on that offside line the whole time absolutely oh with this ball just not quite long enough he did have the pace to beat him oh that's a dummy <laughs> there from the Nottingham player has he kept it on? Oh, fortunately not. <laughs> Ball straight through the middle there, cutting Nottingham apart. They've picked it up though. Here's a ball down the right hand side. Oh, what a stupendous tackle. Well, he couldn't have got that one wrong, did he? <laughs> Well, he had to get it right, yeah. he really did. <laughs> Nottingham thrown into the box, trying to open us up. There's just too many players in the box at the moment. Away. I think. Yeah. That's another great tackle. Really committing to the slide tackles. It is a crisp, kind of dewy night, so the pitch is slippery, yeah, I think. It's ideal for sliding on, isn't it? Yeah, and you say crisp, I, I see you've got the gloves on, you've opted against the hat and, uh, well, hat I'm, and scarf. I'm sure on the pitch they're very warm, but sitting up here I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little chilly. Well, I've come prepared. You I'll are you incredibly what. prepared, yes. Yeah. Got the shirt, the jumper, the hoodie, the jacket, the gloves, the scarf, the hat. I mean, you'd think it was the middle of December. <laughs> you really would. You're dressed for Christmas almost. <laughs> Better to be safe than sorry, I'd say. Oh, absolutely. I'm very envious sitting here right now. <laughs> hey, you wait till the second half. <laughs> yeah, a bit of pushing push in the back there. Bit of a cheap free kick to give away. I must say the throw-ins don't seem to be don't seem to be great at the moment. A lot of throw-ins being wasted. Yeah. Oh taken quickly by Loughborough. Quickly and going well. Great pace on the ball, keeping it moving. And it'll be another corner to Loughborough. The corner here, they do have a player short. They've gone low and straight into the box. Oh, potentially could have been a shot there from the edge of the box. Nottingham with a strong run down the outside. Can't do him with pace now. He's been closed down with three men in purple and yeah, put out for a throw in. He did very well there actually. I didn't have much support with him. He covered a lot of ground. Yeah. Not a lot to cheer about yet. Not too much yet, no. <laughs> Which is ideal for us, because if the uh, well, yeah, as soon as stand, up, stand up, we're in all sorts of trouble. So. <laughs> Ideally, we're looking for an absolute late winner. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, where it doesn't really matter what we say because everyone's losing it. So, yeah, that'd be, that'd be perfect. Absolutely. Final whistle absolutely. straight after. We'll cut the broadcast. It'd be perfect, wouldn't yeah. it? Ideal, absolutely <laughs> ideal. So go on then, 18 minutes in, have you got a score prediction for us, Ed? I think 2-1, two 2-1 one. Two one to Loughborough. 2-1? Two I'm a little bit biased, I will admit, course, but 2-1 yeah. to Loughborough. I think by far we look like the, the more tactical attacking team. Here we have a great move, has he got the ball? No, unfortunately not. But I just think Nottingham are lacking that final bit in the third to yeah. get, that, get that screamer of a goal that they need. What do you reckon? Um, I picked 3-1 before the match, um, and I'm going to stay with it. It's a bold statement. Yep. Four goals. Let's do this. Only takes 60 seconds to score a goal, so still well, plenty yeah. of time. <laughs> I mean, the lack of early chances hasn't been particularly helpful, but but this could be a chance now, no, the, the ball's not good there. Both teams do seem to settle down. Ooh. Another free kick given away in the middle of the park there by Nottingham. Nottingham playing quite an aggressive game. Yeah. And that ball's definitely five yards ahead of where the foul was. 
Ref's discretion. Yep. <laughs> oh. That's unlucky, yeah. Another run down the left hand side by Nottingham. Cut out well by the defence. Defended quite calmly so far, haven't they, Loughborough? Not really panicked when anything's come towards them. There's one quite awkward ball across the box. Yeah. They put themselves in a bit of trouble with, but otherwise, it's been very much business as usual. And no, it's a bit too much on there, isn't it? It's outside the box. Are you going to close it down? <laughs> Safe hands from the keeper there, playing it safe. <coughs> I think both teams early on are both sticking to their game plans. There hasn't yeah. seemed to be too much change on the pitch. It's nice to see Loughborough bringing all 11 men into the game, using the keeper. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, this is a nice run, yeah. Oh, great ball. Great ball there. Loughborough throw in here in the middle of the pitch. Nottingham seems to be giving us a lot more space now. Yeah, it's interesting though. They, they're dropping off just a bit. I wonder if they're struggling to keep that high defensive line. Oh, that was some good control there by Nottingham. Yeah, it's, it's another ball for nothing really, isn't it? Um, Another ball forward, not really searching for anyone. Hopeful thinking, I think it's they call not, it. Oh, yeah. Well, that's a very good ball. And he's got unlucky with the control there. Once again, in the uh, side of the pitch, we can't quite see. Yep. I can't quite say that ball was um, up to the standard of the other it's ones that Loughborough have been doing. That was, it was very hopeful. Yeah, uh, it was rather hopeful. We are asking for a lot of pace there from the right winger, really, to keep up with that one. Ambitious effort. <laughs> we do seem to have a lot of pace in the Loughborough squad, though. Yeah, absolutely. Certainly down the wings, we seem to be outpacing yeah. the players very well. We seem to be using the um, overlapping fullbacks as well. Well, like I said earlier, all 11 men do seem to be involved right now. Yeah. Oh, the dummy not paying off there. Was it a dummy or a miss? I'm not sure. <laughs> so this is Herbert now. Oh, and what a ball. Ooh, this is a great flag one. Is up. Oh, just caught offside. The flag's up. And I can tell you that the sounds in front of me, even from the cameraman to the side of me, um, aren't good sounds. I'm not sure about that one, that oh. looked pretty close to me. The slip paying off there for the Nottingham player. Yeah, he's done well. He wouldn't have got he's it done otherwise. very well. Oh. Yeah, we're halfway through the first half and we have a little bit of controversy with that, with, there with that decision. Yeah, that offside is going to be a game changer maybe later on. Later on. I'd like to uh, revise my predicted score to 2 1 now. 2 1. That, that was my goal, see? That was, that's what I was waiting <laughs> for. <coughs> Another hopeful ball up there from Nottingham. Yeah, very well dealt with by Loughborough as well. And here's well a chance down. for Downey. Oh, no. 
A little bit of miscommunication there with the forwards. Not team, just slowing it down a bit. Well, good use of the head there. Very committed. And Hickey wins the throw. Poor touch there. Given possession away. Advantage played by the referee. On the ball's behind there. And he can't keep it in play. It's a bit of a chance gone begging there for Nottingham. They were on the break. Once again, it's that hopeful ball across the yeah. pitch or up the pitch that's not quite getting there. No Herbert's on the left, cutting inside. He's got a long, he's got a lot of traffic to go through there. He's not quite managed it, but it is one back by Williams. Now, trying a bit of skill there. <laughs> Bryn, I think you can see more than me now, so. <laughs> yeah, I'll take over your head, thank you. <laughs> Yeah, again, a bit of miscommunication there. But again, you can see what Loughborough are trying to do, just playing on, on our last man. And I do think there will come a point where it'll pay off. It almost did with that very tight off side, offside decision earlier on. That's a good ball in space. Can he get the touch control? No. That was well cut out. Yeah, that, very well. that was a move in the making, that was. Game's just opening up a little bit now, isn't it? So you see, seeing a bit more flair on the pitch. Hmm? Not after. Yeah, we've got a screen now. Love for just moving it around, looking for the opening. And here it could be. We're here, but down the left hand side to Williams. Looking for the cross. Oh, he's absolutely ruined him with that bit of skill. The cross. Yeah, the shame cross about the cross. Free kick to Nottingham then. No, sorry, goal kick. Goal kick. <laughs> oh, fantastic, we've got some visions yep. now. Update. Update on the um, on the vision situation, which I know you're all anxiously waiting for updates on back at home. Uh, we now have a screen in front of us, so we can see exactly what you're seeing. So again, Loughborough on the attack here. Oh, that's oh, a lovely this ball. moment. That's oh. All. A fantastic bit of skill there from Just Jack Pogsard. Didn't quite have the finish. I don't I, think he was expecting the ball. No, it, it was too good, wasn't it? That was the thing. And they're making serious inroads now, Loughborough. Oh, wow. How is he still going Some there? really good skill there from the Nottingham player. Yeah, beating. The free kick was somewhat inevitable there, wasn't it? Free kick in a dangerous place here. Yeah. I mean, the game has definitely been in Loughborough's favour uh, for the last, well, for, for most of the first half, actually, yeah, I'd say really. so far. But uh, I wonder if Nottingham can just pinch something, yeah. This is certainly their best chance of the game. 
So two man wall. I'd be surprised if he shoots here, but you never know. We'll find out in a minute. Ball crossed in. Headed away by Loughborough. Got to get it out. They've got to get it out. Well done. Yeah, so again, well dealt with by Loughborough. Once again, though, nothing to really worry the defence. Not really, no. It's, it's not been any kind of cutting edge in it at the moment. Well, the high hope for ball once again. Yeah, just a bit of a shirt pull there. Quite cynical. I's Referee just having a word is it, here. Is this just going to be a word or is... He's not going to go to his pocket for this, is it? It looks like just a warning to me. I, I do wonder if he's just telling them it's, it's been a few now. You know, let's cut it out, otherwise cards will start coming. Well, I think that's the better way to referee. Give them a warning. Oh, absolutely. I tell you what, it's rugby style of refereeing, that is. And that's something we need to see a lot more of in football. Absolutely. So this will be Josh Hill to take the free kick. No, it won't. <laughs> Surprise appearance there for number four. <laughs> Bamboozled everywhere. This looks like a good attacking move. Nottingham looking here, good on the counter attack. Needs a little bit more help. There's a couple of midfielders arriving. That's a fantastic tackle. Really important Brilliant tackle there. Prevention. Nottingham putting some pressure on. This looks like a great ball up the wing. Can he pick it up? Fantastic ball. Oh. Not quite. That was, yeah, thumbs up in, acknowledge, in acknowledgement of that. That was a fantastic ball for him. But that's the difference between the two teams, I think. Our long balls are going yeah. places. They've had thought behind them, haven't they? That's the thing. They, they know what they're trying to do. They've certainly got a strategy and they're certainly sticking to it. Uh, free kick there flagged by the assistant. That's something I like to see as well. The assistant referees getting involved, making yeah, decisions. Yeah, absolutely. does take a bit of pressure off the referee as well, I think. <laughs> Webb here to take the free kick. A lot of shuffling in the box going on. Sent in high. Oh! <laughs> Hitting the crossbar. I tell you there. what, I wonder if he meant that. I do wonder if he meant that. Well, once if again. He did, what an effort. Everyone surprised <laughs> once again there. Nottingham in defence really have 10 men behind the ball. Yeah, absolutely. Playing the park the bus style. That's a very good ball. Cheeky flick there. It's oh, he's picked it up. He's <laughs> he had me wondering, he's dealt with it well and... Interestingly, the free kick's gone against Loughborough. Players seem to be respecting the uh, decision though. To an extent. <laughs> yeah.
Once again, Loughborough playing with a strong back four, keeping their line really well. A bit more organised than the, uh, the Nottingham back four, I feel. This is a good run. run yeah. Dealt with well again by Loughborough. Very calm in defence again. Oh dear. Yeah, not a whole lot in that, but he knew what he was doing, didn't he? Something on the end of this? Yep. Not even just passing it around here, trying to contain it. And this is good football down the right now. Can he get the cross in? Get a cross in. This could be trouble. And it's a very good save. Very, very good save here is near post. That's certainly the best chance Nottingham have had. I think probably the best chance of the match, to be honest. Other than that, the free kick that hit the bar. Or potentially the controversial offside. Well, of course, yeah. Nottingham's first corner then. Let's see what they do with this. Ten minutes left to play in this half. Can they get the first half goal? Dealt with very well with the head. And put away nicely. Even the big hoofed clearances almost look deliberate, don't they? <laughs> almost picked a man out there. Okay. Oh, bit of a slip there from the keeper. It is wet out there. I think there's certainly a frost coming. <laughs> I think looking at me, you'd probably think it was a blizzard, wouldn't you? <laughs> so annoying that I'm on top of Thomas. Because he's got two hands. Just waiting for the opening here, Loughborough. Using the wings well, passing it around. Just not with that killer ball. It's just not quite there at the moment. They've defended well, Nottingham, in, fair to them, uh, in fairness to them. They, we've spoken about their high defensive line, the fact they have been quite vulnerable to the long ball, but when things have come their way, they have dealt with them pretty well. Yeah, I will agree with that. They have. There's always been a man there to get in the way. This is hell. Oh, but this ball could have something on the end of it. Williams. That's well one. Three on one. Nearly got it out. Nearly got it away there. Player in the middle waiting for it. He's on side. Just needs a bit of support now. Uh, there's no one in the box just yet. A couple of men are Cross in. Now. Stopped very well by the Loughborough defence. Using the full width of the pitch here. It's not all just down the middle. Cheeky flick over the top. Yep. Just Flags not quite again. getting there. So the score is still nil-nil, coming up to nearly 40 minutes. Do you think we'll see a goal in the first half? I'd say at the moment it's looking like not well. Right now it looks like it could be a who. Well, someone's feeling brave today. Someone's feeling very brave today. At the moment it, it looks not, to be honest. Um, I think it might come to life in the second half. I can tell you the home crowd not happy with our decision, but it's one back by Loughborough anyway. Ooh. 
Oh, that's Ooh. very late. Very, very late. Some strong tackles here. It looks to me as if there's a card coming out. Yeah, it's been called over. It seems worthy of a yellow card. It was very late. Looks like words of apology there from uh, from the offending player. Number four. <laughs> yeah, no, no surprise to anyone really. It's a yellow card. Not much of a complaint either. First card of the game though, late on. Loughborough on the attack once again. The ball up the wing, just caught offside once again. Nottingham playing that high defensive line, which is catching us all out, I think. He's been getting quite a workout over there, hasn't he, the assistant? He didn't need to go to the gym today, I tell He's you what. He's had his arm up and down many yeah. a time. But that's what they train for. <laughs> yes, indeed. Oh, very skillful move there to get the ball out. Oh, trying the cheeky back heels here. And Nottingham soon to be offside. First time Nottingham have been caught offside, if I'm correct there. I think you might be. <laughs> Ref just having a word here. I wonder what's been said here. Yeah. It's, it's smiles, but I, I wonder what that is that the referee's speaking about. He's not having any of it. No. He sent the player away. I think he's had a decent game so far as well, the referee. From what I can tell, I've not got a lot wrong. I haven't disagreed with many of the decisions. No. Card came out when it needed to come out. I'd say that's probably the only time it needed to. Yeah, there's been no other malicious tackles. No, absolutely. Strong tackle there. Throw in here. Long, not really into any space. Nottingham not using their throw ins to any advantage. Just playing it safe there, moving the ball around the pitch, using each, each wing. It's another nice ball down the right wing there. And they've won the throw in as well. I will say, even though the score reads nil-nil, Loughborough have looked in charge. Absolutely, yeah. Oh, that's a great ball. And this could be a chance now for Loughborough. It's a very played nice ball. ball. It's picked up. I tell you what, the referee has done brilliantly there. So he's played the advantage. Yeah, he's gone back for the free kick. Keeps the game going. You never know what's going to happen. I think the refs made a great call there. This free kick certainly in a dangerous place. Yeah, very dangerous. So we've only got a minute or so until half time if you add on stoppage time then as well. Of which I don't think there'll be very many at all. I mean, what stoppages have we had? No substitutions. No. So No one's gone down injured so far. Be interested to see if there are any subs made at half time. Yeah. So who do you think would need to change more? Well, certainly in the Loughborough side, I think they're looking good. But yeah. I mean, we've got a great defensive line. Perhaps some of the Nottingham players coming off. They've had a really high work rate up and down the wings. So it looks as if it's going to be Alan Webb to take this. 
It is Webb. Oh, and it's a goal. Sensational a goal. Brilliant curler into the left Through hand the corner. Wall. And Loughborough take the lead just before half time. That's a fantastic time to score. Parted the wall like the Red Sea, <laughs> slotted the ball in the I, net. I can't imagine the Nottingham's coach is going to be too happy with the way they um, way they broke apart there, but still a fantastic free kick nonetheless. Nothing the keeper could have done. Oh, absolutely. He's only got his defence to blame for that one, I'm afraid. Right in the nick of time as well, 45 minutes just yeah, coming up now. It's a brilliant time to score. Now, the best way to respond to this with Loughborough is to get another. <laughs> Just before half time. Another long, hopeful ball. Cut out well. The interception made. He knew what the ball was going to do. Well, they haven't dropped the tempo since the goal, but it didn't work out quite that time. I've taken one. Not sure how many minutes of stoppage time we'll have. My prediction's on about two. <laughs> yeah, they tend to have 30 seconds for the gold on there. But there it is. That's the end of the first half. There so go, that's then. the halftime whistle. It's 1 0 uh, to Loughborough at the moment. Loughborough 1, Nottingham 0. Uh, Loughborough have been on top for the majority of the first half, I'd say. Uh, they had a good chance, which was controversially ruled offside um, by the linesman. Nottingham had their chance as well. They had a um, shot which was very, very well saved down in the bottom corner by the Loughborough goalkeeper. Um, but a fantastic free kick just before half time, cemented a 1 0 lead. Um, and it'll be interesting to see how they kick on now in the second half. So many things have changed in years, gone by but never gone. We fought for change, for sex and race, made right what once was wrong. Beneath our shirts we are the same. We compete and fight as one. We wear no labels, signs or names, all equal barring none. It's not the winning or the losing, it's just we can all take part. For what defines the champions is the size of all their hearts. Now all our hearts are different, each and everyone unique. But whichever arena we enter, it's love and friendship that we seek. So when we cross the finish line, when the final whistle bursts, we stand together, arm in arm, bruised and bloodied, but unhurt. It's time to send our message to be honest, open and clear. Sporting champions the world over can be themselves with no more fear. We play for the badge upon our chest with every step and stride. Together we stand to meet the test. Together. 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 We play with pride. Referee tonight in the middle is uh, with the great head is Gary Lord, and he's uh, supported by Craig Hammond, who's uh, Watch Charlotte, works in uh, research finance. 
and Mihal Perrier. So tonight's Bucks big match then is uh, Bucks Premier North, men's football. Top of the table is Sterling at the moment with uh, seven points in four games. Luffer in third with six and three. Um, but have actually achieved the win over Sterling. So uh, this is just actually their game. I do wonder what's been said to them at half time. Uh, I can't imagine it was a grilling. I don't think they, they played all together that badly. They just played slightly without direction, I'd say, in the first half. It's probably the best way of putting it. Absolutely. I think, I think what would have been said would be something like, slow it down, keep the ball on the floor, and speed it up. Well, slow it down and speed Sl it up. Slow it down and speed slow it, it down up. And speed, it up but <laughs> speed up the ball, slow down the play. Yeah. But they've lost it again early on. Well, the first minute's been all Nottingham. <laughs> I wonder Forecast if, for the rest of the half. Is that, is that the tune they're going to play to? I'm hearing some shouts from the crowd that their predictions are also 3-1. 3-1. So you got some backing there. Popular opinion. So this is Bryn Wilkes and Ed Radford coming to you live from the Loughborough University Stadium. As I said, this is the big match uh, to launch the Play with Pride campaign. Uh, fantastic event so far. And the weather's kind of held up as well. It was a really lovely evening. Yeah, yeah, not too bad. A bit chilly, but I've got my coffee in front of me now, so I'm a lot happier. I don't. Didn't get one at half time? No. Oh, error. Only 125 as well. Fantastic. Can't get the staff. Yeah. <laughs> This is a fantastic run forward, a brilliant marauding run forward. Oh, He's been stopped and he's yeah, the referee said he's been stopped cleanly. Fantastic tackle. Strong tackle. <laughs> Strong tackle. Strong yeah. tackle. Luff were going out with the same tactics that they went in with. Oh, loose pass there. There doesn't seem to have been any substitutions made at half time. Sticking with the same teams. But certainly, if it isn't broken, don't fix it. Yeah, absolutely. It's always nice when they, uh, they have 1 to 11 on their tops as well, isn't it? Good old fashioned, fantastic. Certainly helps us. Oh, definitely. <laughs> The long ball. ball on the left-hand side. I think it'll be cut out. Oh. Ooh, Nottingham Take closed that down. Nottingham playing a very strong game. They're using all their body. Strong, but not not altogether dirty so far. They had that one yellow card in the first half. I wouldn't. I wouldn't have said dirty at no. all. No, it's been some clean, clean, good fun to start this uh, second half as well. does seem to be a higher tempo about Nottingham in this half, doesn't it? I think that, that would have been what was said. Yeah. And more space. Certainly seeing a lot, of, lot more Nottingham players in space. But Loughborough defence still holding strong there. Back four. Strong tackle. I'm not sure how much of the ball he took, but <laughs> we'll play on. He was, he was still in the air when he went past. <laughs> I think Loughborough just maybe playing a bit more sensible football. They've got the they've got the goal ahead. They're waiting for their chance, not pushing too hard. Always got to be a little bit careful when you do that, though. Of course, you don't want to be um, caught sitting back too much. Certainly, it's not a big lead. No, two goal lead will feel a lot more comfortable. Give it time. What a ball! What a ball into space there. You, he's played some nice balls today. Jake Weeks and goal. He's. <laughs> He's been launching the attacks, hasn't he? He's been the playmaker, I think. <laughs> He's had a good game. Yeah, he absolutely. Hasn't, hasn't I mean, let, not one save yeah. in the first half. He hasn't let in any goals. <laughs> <laughs> I 
sound in that place. Here we go with Loughborough. An attempt. Oh, just unlucky there. Kept offside, I believe. Some penalty shouts in the crowd, but I'm not sure where from. Nottingham here just waiting to restart the game. Referee just explaining the rules. <laughs> yep, they've complied well there. <laughs> it's always good when they listen, isn't it? Nottingham playing some really sensible football here. Not showing Loughborough too much of the ball. Strong, strong run up the side. Goal. Just needs support in the box now. And again, very well defended by Loughborough. Incredibly calm once again. And of course, they're shifting the ball across rather than just hoofing it along. They're looking for space now in midfield, seeing what they can do with the ball instead. Nottingham do seem to be very strong on this left-hand side. Mm, absolutely. Okay, there's a free kick for Loughborough. Everyone seems slightly perplexed by that, but we'll go on. Taken quickly, the game goes on. And another free kick to Loughborough. They're making gains. It's like watching a game of Union. <laughs> Free kick taken from the correct place. <laughs> <laughs> I'll make the referee happy. And it's out for a throw in then on this far side. If this were a rugby match, we'd be doing incredibly well here. We seem to have made about 20 metres <laughs> in uh, three plays. Oh, he's running this through them. Fantastic run. It's like a hot oh, knife through butter. Him. And it's, it's very well defended actually in the end by Nottingham. Not so sure about the ball forward though. The crowd were almost elated there for a second. There was a spider on our wire. Look at that. Oh, he's come yeah. to watch the game. <laughs> well, he's got a great view right in front of our little screen. <laughs> that interception made very well from Nottingham. Cut the ball right out. We'll go back for the free kick there. Just a bit too much hassling there from the Loughborough players. Just need to watch that. And another free kick. Nottingham playing a similar sort of game. Taking their free kicks, making a couple <laughs> of yards. And it's, it's been a strange start to this half, actually, isn't it? <laughs> Very strange. I mean, we're 13 minutes in. And there's, well, must have been about five free kicks, would you say? <laughs> <laughs> no warnings, no cards or anything like no, that, though. Yet. Very harmless tackles. Just imagine if they keep adding up, they'll have to be warnings at some point. I love here with a big attack. They've got players. Can they do something with it? Using the wings. Taking it out wide once again. Oh, the block there. Very, very good, good tackle, but Loughborough still on the ball. And that is, yeah, throw into Loughborough. And the screen is coming into its own, isn't it? It really oh, it's is. a great shot. Revolutionizes right? our lives. It certainly helps <laughs> us on this side. Yeah. Here's an opportunity for Loughborough once again. That's some lovely football Here we go. the box. Here's a chance. The shot just lacking the power it needed. Yeah, just too close to the goalkeeper there as well. But fantastic move, it really was. Um, just got to be careful. Ooh, very risky there, <laughs> very risky. 
keeper did just have to be aware of being lobbed there by his own man. Oh, that guy there at the front playing for Nottingham, he's got some pace. He, he has, closed yeah. that ball down. Well done the first half. And the flag's up on this near side. Once again, Loughborough being caught offside. And there's going to be a substitution. And it's a Nottingham player by the looks of it. So first change of the match. Number 17 coming on for number 11. Just looks like they're changing their strike force a bit then. Yeah. Controlled well there. But one back by Loughborough. And switched very, very cleverly there. And the overlapping fullback, Elliot Leg. Oh, what a ball. Can he do something with it? Ooh. Oh, great intervention. The but ball's dropped well. Here's a massive chance for Loughborough. Surely are. Saved and held. That's two big chances Loughborough have had now, early on in the second half. I think they've certainly found the way through down this right-hand oh, side. Absolutely. They're just switching it so well. Yeah, they're just they're thinking about um, the pitch in a much more, well, sort of two-dimensional way than Nottingham at the moment. Nottingham, Nottingham are, caught offside here. There are a lot about up and down Nottingham, whereas Loughborough are moving the ball left and right a lot more. Traversing, I think is the word Traver we're for. Traversing, fantastic. They're traversing the pitch. <laughs> Going to try the same wing again. Ooh, sure playing some risky, that. risky football here. He's, he's gone down. It looked as if it hit a hand as well, but uh, the referee's playing this on. That's the first time I've seen the Loughborough defence in a bit of a frenzy. Yeah. I wonder what Nottingham can make of this. It's a good tackle, actually. But the ball's still with green shirts. Although Loughborough seems to have most of the chances, I must say, in the midfield, it does look like they're very evenly matched. Yeah. Can they get it out? Yeah. Playing it up. That's, that's well played. I, th I think the referee's made the right call there, actually. I think that's hit him in the chest. Caught offside again. Not on being beaten out here by their own game. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there was a lot of complaints about that handball, but it, to me it looked like it hit him in the chest. I don't know what you well, think. I think. I think it was ball to hand. There was nothing intentional oh, yeah. about it. Either way. Not letting them down that right-hand side again. Back to the goalkeeper. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I tell you what, I like this centre-back. I do like him. He's having a go, isn't he? <laughs> Referee just having a few words there. With the captain. Yeah, I mean, he's been quite busy with his whistle in this half. There's, there's been a lot more fouls than in the first half. I think maybe soon he'll begin to crack down on that. Yeah, I think he'll have to. We're going to see a marauding run forward now, not this time. Just not quite picking their passes at the moment, Loughborough. No, a bit wayward. Quite. Got the ball back, though. Is there something on the end of this? Oh, absolutely well, horrendous tackle there. Let's see what the referee does about this. I tell you what, he's off the ground there. He's off the ground. This could be the colour, I think. Let's see what the referee does. Is this number six? It was not a nice tackle at all. Looks to me like it'd be a yellow card. It looks like a booking at the moment, yeah. In some respects, I think he's got off lucky. That was I, a two-footed tackle. It, it was, yeah, he was very high. 
No real need for the tackle either. It's a, it's a yellow card. And I will tell you, that did incense the, uh, the crowd in front of us in the main stand. Admittedly, a Loughborough-based crowd. <laughs> of course, yeah, of course. But even but, from a, an obviously non-biased point here, yeah. it did look a bit... <laughs> It did look a bit full on. Yeah. And you always wonder when you have these kind of flashpoints, what effect it'll have on the rest of the match. I think certainly Loughborough could have benefited from having a man over on the pitch. And I oh, think absolutely. Nottingham really can't afford to lose a man. Good touch there. Oh, and that's again. fantastic. That's absolutely brilliant from Elliot Legg. Bit of shirt grabbing there. And he's played a good advantage here, the referee, actually. And this is a chance for Loughborough. The shot. On Can't target, but blocked. Face, by the looks of it. Looking a little and bit... Just the throw-in, I think, yep. Looking a little bit more uh, boisterous out there. It really has been in the second half, hasn't it? Um, game stopped. We Can't be sure why there doesn't seem to be any substitutions being made. Looks to me as if the uh, Luffer player just having a word about something that annoyed him yeah. earlier on. Just making the referee aware. <laughs> Obviously, they can't be everywhere all the time. <laughs> Making the referee aware. I, I like that way of yeah. putting it. It's Not to no one, really. Getting the ball out, I think. Kind of trying to give them some space to reorganise. Oh, what a ball. That's a very nice ball. He's picked it up. It's gone down under the challenge. Good tackle. Ball still with Loughborough. Can they make something from this? Ooh, well, it was worth a try. An ambitious shot, a long way out. Yeah, worth a try though. Struck it fairly well. Only a foot or so above the bar. Yeah. It's getting to the point now in the game. I, I said earlier on about um, the one goal lead, you know, always being a little bit precarious. It's getting to the point now where they've had all these chances. I wonder if they're just getting a little bit edgy about not being able to pull, ahead, pull that bit further ahead. I think they'd certainly be a lot more comfortable with that, that one more goal. Mm. They've certainly been the better team, there's no doubt about that. Nottingham really haven't really done anything with their chances. I think that's. Mm. Mind you, our back four haven't given them the chances. Or well, Loughborough back four, sorry. Not our back four. Is, yeah, <laughs> of course. Big throw in there. Cut out well. Cut out. Yeah, it was a bit of a foot race, but I had a bit too much of a head start there. Keeper needs to do something with it. Oh, you want to be careful doing that. You want to be very careful doing that. Nottingham here on the counter. On this left -hand side. That's a really good ball from Nottingham. Another really open in the box. Can he do something with it? The cross goes in. An oh. ambitious flick. It was, that was a chance though, wasn't it? They had a lot of men pouring forward. A fantastic ball down the left-hand side. A quick goal kick taken by Loughborough. I think maybe the, the cross rushed. Yeah. Not a good pass there. Wasted possession. They've got it back though, he's made up for his mistake. Yeah, you can see what he's trying to do there, just couldn't quite pick out the man. It's a bit ambitious. I mean, it goes back to what Nottingham were doing in yeah. the first half. We're learning now that uh, the cameraman just to uh, the left of us probably should have brought his gloves today.
We're not all as experienced as you, Bryn. <laughs> That's true. I've got this right today. I've even got two pairs of socks on. Oh, very well won in the middle of the park. Very, very well run. Some firm but fair tackles going on yeah. out there. The pace of the game really seems to have speeded up. It's real good movement of the ball. Switch made very nicely there. I think the more the more of a physical battle this game becomes, the more it will favour Nottingham, I'd say, because they are the probably the physically stronger of the sides. I think Especially in midfield, they seem to be winning those little battles when it becomes physical. And certainly their back four aren't afraid of getting stuck in. Mm, absolutely. Perhaps Luffer have been a bit too tentative. Do we think they have it in them? That's, that's a good point. Yeah, a bit of a waste there down the right-hand side. The game's almost speeded up too much. <laughs> I mean, people people can't keep up themselves. We're struggling here. <laughs> well, I am. So I wonder now, with 25 minutes left, well, there, there or thereabouts, wonder if we're going to see any more changes anytime soon. Nothing from the Loughborough branch just yet. One change from Nottingham. Last... I think in the last 15, 20 minutes, there's, there's going to be some changes made, just to inject some pace into the game. It's, it's always a difficult situation anyway, um, because you, know, you make a change at 1-0, you might make an attacking change if you're Nottingham, a defensive change if you're Loughborough. One goal, and that throws your tactics out the window, and you've well, got absolutely. one too many attacker or one too many defender on the pitch. I mean, do either team have that super sub who can come on and change mm -hmm. the game? harmlessly through to the goalkeeper. Loughborough keeper not really being worked too hard. No, not in this half. One scare early on, but mm. nothing else. <coughs> That's the first time I think I've seen him not put the ball in yeah. to a Loughborough player. And again, calmly dealt with. That was a good ball, Oof. once again. <laughs> what a flick, can he get on the end of it? Not quite. Not quite, it's right idea. Nottingham seems to be closing down on this right-hand side, just stopping Loughborough getting through. Yeah. <laughs> good tackle there. It's a very good tackle. But free kick to Nottingham. Oh, given away very cheaply, and this could be an opportunity. It's a big opportunity for Nottingham here. What very a tackle. tackle. I'll tell you one thing I've noticed actually with um, oh, it's been it's Loughborough's throwing as well. Loughborough's throwing. Fantastic result for the home team. But yeah, w one thing I've noticed is when they've had these attacks down the, uh, down the wings, Nottingham, they've not had the players busting a gut from midfield to get into the box. Very often it's been one man or even none at all actually looking to get on the end of a cross. Absolutely. Which is killing the momentum of the move dead, really. Well, they're playing this kind of almost one up front mm. with the two behind. And it's the two behind are just, just not getting there. This ball, he's on side. Well, Can he get there? He's on side. He can't quite get there. It's a good idea. There's a sweeper-keeper moment there.
Oh, you want to be careful doing that. Once again, risky. The ball just being given away cheaply by Loughborough here. He's very offside there. I was wondering if he was going to look to uh, put that in from 45 yards. <laughs> well, goal was open. Yeah, it was. was there. Now and again, you do see him happen, don't you? What a That's ball a down the wing. On the right hand side. So this is Webb. Webbed for 2 0. It's 2 0, Loughborough. That's the goal we needed. Yeah, is that the goal that kills off the contest? What a fantastic ball down the right hand side. Brilliant. Brilliant run in from Webb. And a lovely finish at the near post as well. I struggle to see how Nottingham are going to really come back from that now. Actually, analysing that goal, it was a really good finish from that kind of angle. Oh, fantastic finish. He had no right to put it there, really. He kept calm under the pressure. Yeah. Fantastic result. No, I think, yeah, this will be the time that changes are made if they're going to be. I think certainly now Loughborough can afford to bring on maybe a more defensive yeah. player. And Nottingham really need to step it up and with some attack. The worry really is for Nottingham is that Loughborough have been the better team at holding the ball. So if Loughborough want to just keep hold of possession, they're likely to be able to. Ooh, i tell you what, I didn't sound good. <laughs> a loud crunch coming from the... Uh, <laughs> side of the pitch there. Yeah, one would think Loughborough will just be able to hold on to this now. But like you said, they don't want to sit too deep. Of course, yeah. That's when you invite trouble onto yourself. Best defence is always a good offence. If they can just keep possession, keep moving the ball around, we should be okay. Oh. Nottingham here on the attack again. Just not there's enough players two, in the box. Two men in the box now, and he's found one of them. And that's a very, very good save with the feet by Jake Weeks. Still danger though. He hasn't had a lot to do all game, but he's kept his wits sharp. That was a really good save there. Bit of commotion there for the throw-in. Referee just signalling for everyone just to, just to calm down. Yeah, Jake Weeks really has a, had a very good game in goal, isn't he? It's, it's two, you know, he's, as you said, he's not had that much to do, but it's two real quality saves he's made, one in each half. What he has had to do has been amazing. <laughs> well done, almost got loaded, loaded into the trap there. Still a strong 15 minutes to play though. Oh, oh he's just caught offside there. Can't have been much in that one. I must say I didn't see it, but it looked very close. Yeah, very close. And you don't want to give Alan Webb a lot of room down that right-hand side, as he showed just a few minutes ago. I imagine the Nottingham coach will be signalling down there to get over on this uh, right-hand side mm -hmm. and stop that, stop that attack get happening again. <laughs> so referee stopped the game again. Not sure why this time. Nope. <laughs> Chickies. Nice um, <laughs> pat of reassurance. We'll yeah. that. It was affectionate, wasn't it? It's all love for with the free kick then. Okay. 
So leg, cutting inside again. He's done this a few times. Tackle Crunching. fairly, says the referee. He's kept the ball. Can you do something with it? Oh, oh this ball. could be where this could be three now. It's a lovely finish. It's three nil. And the game is certainly beyond Nottingham now. Loughborough just running away with it now. <laughs> Another brilliant finish by Alan Webb. A great run. A good ball to pick him out. Is that another and one for Webb? It was another one for Webb. So 15 minutes to go. Surely the game has been put to bed now. And we only need a Nottingham goal. And I'll be right with my prediction. <laughs> that one has thrown me right out the window. <laughs> With a superb finish, and that's Loughborough 1's 3, Nottingham 1's nil. And uh, third goal of the evening for number 7, Alan Webb. He's got this very right today, isn't he, Alan Webb? It's a big match, it's down at the stadium, it's the big stage. It's been streamed live on LSU TV, and he's gone and banged in a hat trick. He's certainly stepped up. Yeah. Saw the pressure of the big occasion and rise to it. Yeah. Nottingham may be looking a bit dejected now. I wonder what their plan will be. Back to their old tactics. That's, this could work though. Ooh. Yeah. The, Once again. He had to be very, very sure about coming out there, Jake Weeks. Jake Weeks. Made sure he got team. there. He does. We trust Jake. And lost cheaply there. And that really should be a yellow card. <laughs> it has to be a yellow card. I did just hear the left vice chancellor shouting for a red. <laughs> I can't see that happening myself. I think this will be yellow. Looks to me like a yellow again. Yeah, it'll be yellow. Against the Vice Chancellor's recommendation. Who'd have thought it? Referee making a big decision there. I mean, it's, to be fair, it's almost two yellow card fouls in one because he grabbed hold of him. And did it again. Re yeah, and then just, <laughs> just grabbed him again. Number four, not happy about that. No. Number five, very happy about that. <laughs> so Loughborough make their first change. Uh, it's going to be James Capon to come on. This may be the, the more defensive player that Loughborough were looking for. Yeah. James Capon, and uh, he replaces Number nine, Jack Foxen. So let's see if, if that does change the shape at all. 11 minutes to go. I don't think they should be worrying about the lead too much, but as Loughborough, I say that. Loughborough was playing a 4-2-4 now. <laughs> Well, of course, Webb did bang in his hat trick from the right wing, didn't he? Hat trick. Hat trick. Has he got a hat trick now? That's, that's what the guy on the thing said. That's amazing. <laughs> He's had a great game. He has. Don't forget to check out the new Hollywell Fitness Centre to the uh, <laughs> left of the Luffy University Stadium. Uh, memberships are still available and uh, check out Luffy Sport website for our brand new Hollywell Fitness. Nearly one back for Nottingham. Oh, very good chance there for Nottingham. Out of seemingly nothing, really. 
They've had very little pressure in the last 20 minutes or so. Last 10 minutes here. Two balls on the pitch. <laughs> Speed up the game Making a bit. Making it a bit more fun. That's a nice touch for our cameraman down there. So w will they go for keep ball here or will they look to score another one, Love, bro? Nottingham really stepping up the pressure. Yeah. This potentially a chance. Referee just having a word here. Oh no, sorry, that was the wall walking up. <coughs> Free kick in a dangerous position. So will for Nottingham. Nottingham will Nottingham be able to pull one back? Yeah, they did hit the post just a matter of minutes ago. Oh, well yeah, cleared. cleared away. And Loughborough could break here if they choose to, although there's a lot of pressure on him. But yeah, very good tackle in the end. <coughs> so don't forget on Sunday at 12 o'clock, you can tune into LSU Live on lsu.co.uk um, slash LSU TV. It'll be a sports special uh, following on from Durham D-Day last week and, of course, the Play With Pride big match uh, today. Um, so, yeah, 12 o'clock Sunday on LSU TV. That's LSU Live. So Loughborough are looking to keep the ball here. Um, maybe they don't want to do it so deep in their own half, but... Nottingham not really looking too threatening at the moment, though. As we say that, it's a nice turn. He needs a bit of support, yeah. A very wayward pass there. Yeah, straight out for a throw in. Panicked and a bit. There'll be no hurry to take this, and... Second substitution. There'll be a substitution here for Loughborough. And one for Nottingham as well, but the looks of it is two of them ready to come on. And he replaces in the midfield number 10, Brady Hickey. So it's Brady Hickey off. And it'll be George Carpenter to take his place. So it's going to be seven minutes of big match experience there uh, for George Carpenter. Brady Hickey having, having played very well today. Number 16 on for Nottingham there. Just maybe another attacking player. Just try and get that goal back. Yeah, I've got my fingers crossed. <laughs> Ball played into space here. Could it yeah, be could another be one down the again. wing? Yep. Yeah. Webb has got a bit of space. Needs men in the box now. Just couldn't get the ball through. Yeah, it's well defended in the end by Nottingham, who could look to break now. Yeah, there's quite a lot of space in midfield now. What can they do with it? Oh, it's well won. Very, very well won. Here at Loughborough on the counter again. The ball falling awkwardly for number 11, but he picked it up well. Ooh. Oh, lovely ball. Fantastic ball for Alan Webb. What can he do here? He's got men to choose from, and it's 4 0. 4 0, Loughborough. <laughs> and who else with the assist but Alan Webb? But the goal is James K uh, K Bonds. Your man of the match, Bryn. Uh, I don't think, don't think there's any contest really. I think it has to be number seven, Alan Webb. Um, I mean, it's, there's been a number of notable um, performances from Loughborough. Uh, the two fullbacks have played very well, getting forward, overlapping. But 
Yeah, I think Alan Webb has got to be three goals and that assist as well. Uh, he's just been an absolute demon on the right hand side. Jake Weeks as well had a really good game. Oh, absolutely. Be really, really solid defence. Yeah, it, it looks it looks comfortable now at four 0 but let's not forget he made two very good saves that really, really could have changed the game. <laughs> Five minutes out of time to be played, maybe. No, no it's no. a substitution. Number five coming off. So it's Luke Trotman. Let's have a few minutes. Four nil really is a good result. Yes. I mean, we we saw throughout the first half that Loughborough did have the best best of the play, the best of the chances, but it was always just a question whether it would break through. And I think that first goal just changed it well. I, I, I was just saying that, I think the second goal changed it more than anything. After that second goal, they relaxed, didn't they? Certainly settled into their groove. Yeah. Found the gap in the Nottingham defence and they've just exploited it again and again. Here we go again. Possibly getting one through. Not quite this time. Left for the goalkeeper. The ball just bounced quite near us and the pitch sounding very wet. <laughs> Paying dividends to those slides. <laughs> so I wonder if they'll look for five here, Loughborough. Well, why not? It certainly looks that way. Oh. Is that, yeah, flags up on this near side. Just over two and a half minutes left of normal time. Do you think we'll see any more goals? I fancy one more, you know. Well, both our predictions have gone. On yep, three ones out the window. Two ones certainly gone. <laughs> it's, it's turned into quite an occasion, really, for the home side, hasn't it? Um, you know, after the fantastic uh, play with Pride launch that was done inside the uh, inside the building of the main stand. Players have certainly done it justice. Yeah, absolutely. It, it would have been a shame to get heavily beaten after that brilliant event, but it's oh, not happening. Alan Webb just having fun now. <laughs> oh. oh, just no one on the end of it. Playing with a bit more flair now, Love Brother, they're in a more yeah. comfortable position. Nottingham just. Yeah, not and they were quite. top of um, the Bucks Premier North League already before this fixture. And, yeah, this is the kind of win that's it's going to give you a lot of momentum going forward, isn't it? It's certainly with us. I think we'll just have to see what happens later on in the season. Yeah. But it's looking good. We've got a strong side here, as shown today. That was a nice <laughs> hugging tackle to bring him down. <laughs> He's just being friendly. And let's not forget the, uh, the Bucks Big Wednesday. This year is going to be hosted in Loughborough uh, in March. So... If Loughborough are to make the final of the championship, it will be hosted right here in the stadium. What a big game that'll be. I mean, that's, that's an incentive for the teams across the sports that are participating in Bucks Big Wednesday to be able to compete in that kind of event on home soil. It's just such an incentive. It's an incentive for any team, really, to play at Loughborough. Hmm. And of course, you'll have to look out for LSU Media's uh, coverage of Bucks Big Wednesday. It's still in development at the moment, but it's looking promising anyway. Not even looking good on the ball here. Potentially something on this. Nice. Oh, and he's placed it over the bar. Only just over the bar. Yeah. As the game draws to a close now, we'd just like to thank, on behalf of Lucas Student Union President Rob Whitaker and LSU. BP Sports, Steph Lloyd, and uh, Izzy as well. Thank everybody who's attended today and supported our Play With Pride initiative. I'd like to thank the Vice Chancellor of Loughborough University, Professor Robert Allison.
Yes, I, I wasn't that bothered about getting a personal thank you anyway, to be honest. It's all right. Personal, personal thanks is overrated. <laughs> and going from, from a personal note, I'd like to thank everyone who's been involved in um, the LSU media production um, of this show as well. It's, it's been... It's been uh, fantastic. I hope you've all enjoyed it at home as well. I've certainly enjoyed commentating. I hope you have as well, Ed. Oh, I certainly have. It's been a great game to sit here and watch. So, yeah, big thanks to everyone involved in the production of it. Just winding the game down here. Yeah. I think Nottingham may be waiting for the final whistle. We'd like to thank you all very, very much for coming out to support play with pride tonight. Last big moment of the game for Nottingham. Yeah, let's see if they can just pinch one, just spoil the party just slightly. Look to whip it in left footed by the looks of it. A few men to choose from in the box. Bit of moving around here. Maybe just winding down the clock. I'm not sure if they're making a change here, Love, but someone's heading to the bench. Just getting an early drink. <laughs> well, the ball comes in. Just missing yeah, the header. It's missed everyone, and I think a free kick's been given for a push there, is it? Yeah, free kick, Love, I think that sums up the game for Nottingham, really. Yeah, I think it does, actually. In the a more details of uh, Play With Pride, please see all Lupper Student Union websites and uh, social media. Next game on this pitch will be on Tuesday when uh, Lupper University FC take on Harbour Town. And that'll be it. A fantastic Union. occasion, a fantastic game. event, Please and in the end, a fantastic Thank result for Loughborough. Last home game is with us. Great result for Loughborough, great result for the league. Great result for Play for Pride, really. Yeah. So it was a very good first half from Loughborough, um, but they could only pinch that one goal right at the end, courtesy of that fantastic free kick. Uh, the, f the second half started in a rather scrappy manner, a, you know, a little bit more niggly than the first half. But after the second goal, uh, the floodgates really opened, and I think 4 0 probably is a fair representation of how fair the match went, really. Yeah. I think you summed it up very well. So thank you for joining us today um, on LSU TV, um, a production for LSU Media. I've been Bryn Wilkes. This has been Ed Radford. Um, yeah, big thanks to everyone involved in the production. Hope you all enjoyed it at home. And we'll see you again soon. We'll see you Sunday at 12 for LSU Live, the sports special. Thanks very much.